The 2014 Canisius men's soccer season started like so many seasons before. With welcome back handshakes, team meetings, and headshots. Oh, the Mo. Mo's okay. Mo's okay? Yeah. yeah, that is a good one. For this year's edition of the Golden Griffins and the program's seven member senior class, the goal is simple win the MAC championship. <laughs> Let's get a um, snarling photo first. Come on, come on. Snarl. Three, one, two, three. Oh, classic. <laughs> Absolutely <laughs> classic. <laughs>
um, and we're ranked, I think, third from last in the RPI. So it was obviously a rebuilding, big rebuilding task. You know, I scheduled a meeting with them, came here, saw the campus, sat down with them, and you know, right then I had a feeling. I had already visited another school, but I had a feeling like Canisius was the best opportunity, and I, I knew I, I was going to go. After the Griffs opened the season with a pair of tough losses in a tournament at Ohio State, the team ripped off four straight victories, with three of those coming at home. That set up a rivalry game against St. Bonaventure on homecoming weekend and a chance for a record-setting fifth straight win. This is a team who's not scored a goal in the regular season. Right? Only played three games. They've lost all three and they have not scored. If we allow them an early goal, it's going to give them hope, all right? We know we're going to get chances to score, all right? Don't care if it's like the last game where it comes in the last 10 minutes of the game. We will score. Do not let them get on the board, okay? Let's make sure with the chances that we get today, can we be composed? We've done a lot of finishing this week. Be composed, find the target, hit the next. We've got to keep the tempo up, work rate up, right? Force them to work harder than they want to. Okay? And the last thing is on the home field again. Okay? Let's keep our record as it is at home. Let's go out and show who we are. Come on, high five. Come on, high five. Yeah. Go boys. <laughs> go boys. Big day. Boys. Derek Meyer's goal in the game's 62nd minute put the Griffs up 2 to nothing, but two late goals by the Bonnies sent the game into overtime. In overtime, Canisius freshman Lucien Prize banged home the game winner 3 minutes and 34 seconds into OT to give the Blue and Gold their school record 5 game winning streak. What's been great to see is I brought in a big freshman class my first year. So to watch them now as seniors and see the maturity and the development they've had over the course of the four years is amazing for me. I think maybe about a month or two in, coach sat me down and said, you know, I've been talking with the guys and I think, you know, you have a great um, ability to lead and, you know, you're a vocal player and, you know, you, you put in a work and he said, would I, I don't know how, how it's going to be yet, but he asked me if I would be interested in being a captain or anything like that, and I said, 100%. You know, I'd love to, you know, be a leader on this team and, and try to get these guys to where they need to be. Each year, our, our recruiting classes just continue to get better. Our, the talent level on our team is, is tremendous right now. As soon as we got together as a group and started training, we saw that we could do something special and that we just need to, to get everybody going in the right direction. And, and as long as we could do that, this team is definitely going places. The soccer program is 
nothing similar to the one I inherited. You know, I think the average, the team GPA when I got here was a 2.4. We last year we were over a 3.1. Um, you know, everything's in the right way. We've got the right type of player. We've got the right talent level, and it's going to continue to improve. Yeah. Well, we sat down at the beginning of the season we, and we discussed our goals and. Basically, we want to be MAC champs. Obviously, that's the goal for every team here. And if it's not, I, uh, there's something wrong. But this is a year that we actually believe that this is within reach. And obviously, building upon that, if we can win the MAC tournament, that gives us an automatic bid to the NCAA tournament, a place where Kanisha soccer's never been. And you know, we could really set a standard for Kanisha soccer going forward. And we think this is the team to do it. I hope you have the same confidence as I do in how we play. We've done well in the out-conference. Right now, we're sitting top of our league. We're riding a six-game unbeaten streak, which is great. We're playing the way I want us to play. What this does for us, though, is now we have got a massive target on our back. Right? Obviously, <coughs> people are going to now raise their game to play us. We've become a team to beat. You know what, man? On this, good. We need to be ready for it. They will try and probably get a lot of people out to the game, and they will be worried about playing us, guys. We beat them last year, right? And we're doing well this year. They are gonna know. They they're gonna be worried about this. So we need to be ready for the challenge. Basically, we need Kiffin off the board, same as always. First forty-five, get ourselves figured out, right?